impressive was that catch by Hicks? Oh, just amazing. Just, you know, not only the catch and, you know, getting over in the gap like that, but also just the situation, you know, game on line and um, great hitter over the plate and for him to go out there and have a great read and right off the bat I knew he was going to catch it. You know, just where he was positioned and off the bat, I was like, he's, he's got that no problem. So that was amazing. Pretty bold statement because that was an unbelievable catch. It was just the read that he got that told you that or your confidence in him as a center fielder? I played around him for a couple of years now. I know what balls he can get to him and not. And, you know, I knew right off the bat he was going to make that play. You know, just, you know, especially coming up and hitting that home run early in the game and how pumped up and excited he was. Man, it's very few center fielders or very few offers in the game can ever make that play. So it's impressive. Eric, how would you just kind of describe overall this night, five hours, three minutes, the back and forth? particularly late in the game, you guys being down 8-2, to two, and then, you know, a couple of blown saves, just how the whole night unfolding. Yeah, just two of the best teams in the AL battling for, you know, it's, you know, it's, every game matters. You know, it's, even though it's, it's still July, every game matters. It's a postseason game right there. And they're, they're going out there giving their best. We're going out there giving our best. And it just came down to who wanted it more at the end. And, you know, we, you know, battled and clawed and, you know, came out with a win. You're playing in a game like that. Does it feel like a grind as you're going through it? Or is it something where there's just so much adrenaline because of the lead changes that you're dialed in? Oh, it's fun. Every minute of it. You know, even going down down and you know them taking the lead that's fun you know who wants it more who's going to step up and you know deliver the big big hit for us and you know guy after guy continue to do that and this is what this team's about this team's made for that's what championship teams are made of cd gregorius seven rbis tonight <laughs> what did you think of the job he did in the batter's box oh just just so consistent you know i know people said he was struggling earlier but he's he's never struggling and that's what dd does he's going to go out there and keep giving you quality at bats doesn't matter if the guy's on base or if he needs to start the start the rally for us he continues to do that and that was, that was fun to watch tonight. I got the chance to be on base for a couple of those hits, so it was fun to watch him work up there. You think of the Twins, some people have thought, you know, like a, almost had an October feel to it. Uh, what, what do you think of them in the last two games you guys have played against them? And, uh, well, they're a great, great team, you know, one of the best in the AL, and, um, you know, they showed that tonight. You know, they went out there and battled and were able to put up that many runs, and you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see them again down the road for sure. Kepler hit sack, you think it's trouble? No. Just because Aaron is attracted or he makes plays like that? Or? Yeah, that's the plays he makes. That's why he plays center field for the New York Yankees. He makes plays like that. And, uh, right off the bat,